quick get out my way yeah, when I come I say get out of my way when I pull up in the Audi I'll shoot it out with a Saudi I got the pop in the Audi If he's acting too rowdy Hey, ha, clap in the howdy Hey, I'll put his ass to sleep and now that nigga let you know I'll sit Hey, what's up you guys? It's Sunny Ovi and I'm here to do a pick a card game I have not done one in forever so yeah um obviously as you can tell by the title this is going to be messages that you need to hear during this time and what your divine god and angels have been trying to tell you as well now you have an option of choosing between one two three and four you can pause this video if you want um to give yourself a little extra time you can pick more than one number it is okay it's honestly all up to you just allow for your mind to be open and to understand what your god wants you to hear so go ahead and pick your number and yeah let's get sorted let's see so what you need to know during this time for people that chose card number one throat chakra some of you you're having a hard time speaking your truth or just speaking up in general you have disappointed yourself due to you not being your own savior you have put yourself into situations and a lot of heartache because you weren't woman enough or man enough to speak up some of you, you have a beautiful voice and you need to start using it. Or you have the ability to speak up for not only yourself, but for others. And understand that you are the voice of the people in some cases. Some of you, you need to speak good things. You need to allow for others to speak good things about you as well. With this message, I keep, well, with this card, excuse me, I keep picking up, you are the company that you keep. So be mindful of the people that um, that you surround yourself with. And if they have a bad reputation, know that there's something within them that kind of mirrors something within you. And you're going to have to really understand how you feel about that. Are you ready to heal from it? Are you ready to let that trait of you go like right now you guys are going to have to not only speak your truth speak your actions but pursue with the things that you say that you're going to do some of you guys random you need to get a new cell phone okay or you need to get a new number Things have been difficult. Voice your opinion. Even if it's to your divine God and angels. Like let them know I don't like something. I want this to change. They will make it happen for you. But once again at the same time. You're going to have to put those actions. With those words. Okay. Next we have in the near future. Things will get better in the near future. You are going to have to have a lot of faith and or your ability to speak your truth. Your ability to maybe change up your friends is going to get a little bit better in the near future. I find this really interesting. I don't really use these cards often. But there's two little angels If my card. No, my camera's not going to do it right. But there's two angels in this card right here and one of them has a torch so someone or yourself is going to be once again the voice my throat is messing up too so that's kind of funny uh, it's going to be the voice for a particular person um or you you are going to be able to save someone because you're speaking up because you know the truth Honestly, do the right thing with your voice. Next, we have be honest with yourself. Yes, this is definitely tying into the whole throat chakra. Be honest with yourself. Be loyal to yourself and to others as well. And don't, once again, you know, the people that you are attracting or the people that um, are around you right now that aren't the best 
and are a bit negative understand why this person is in your life and why they kind of mirror you in a way it may not be the exact trait of this person but something about this person is kind of matching you some way somehow and you're going to have to be honest about it hell you know it could be that person's anger you know like that person is always fussing and yelling and getting mad quick are you getting mad quick you know do you fuss a lot like what is it that you do that kind of mirrors this person that's getting on your damn nerves um some of you you are going through a rebirth so things are going to get difficult but just know by the end of summer you will be okay thank you for watching all right so people that chose card number two what does your divine god and angels want you to hear all right we have universe and this is actually the world you're going through a storm right now whether there's actual storms or earthquakes in your area or just in your own spiritual physical realm you're going through just a lot of oppression you're going through a lot of poverty you're going through a lot of obstacles but understand that you will come out of it squeaky clean I'm hearing tests of time you're going through this difficult time for a reason and yes you will go through even more difficult times but you are being prepared for tough skin you are being prepared in order for you to be that leader or that mentor for someone else it's kind of like you know how like when you go to therapy sometimes you feel as if your therapist doesn't understand you because they don't they didn't go through what you are going through or went through and it's kind of like your divine god and angels want you to be able to relate to a particular audience that you're going to have to come in contact with in the future that's why you're going through all these blockages and hurdles and ups and downs because they want you to be able to understand how it feels you know to be in this particular position so that someone can't put it in your face oh you don't know what i'm going through you never went through it I keep picking up on like this mother goose type of vibe. So some of you are going to be a mom very soon. Um, but on another note, like they want you to just once again, just be relatable. Some of you, you are, you have to see things with, uh, from face value. You're going to have to see things for what they are. Don't change it. Don't try to paint over it understand you're seeing it for a reason and that's just honestly how it is especially when you're dealing with another individual some of you you are going to gain a lot of wisdom doing dealing with negative people dealing with um these weird issues once again it's all molding you it's all molding you um the angels are saying you're going through a karmic time right now as well some of you you're trying to figure out if you are on the right path and yes you are it may not feel like it but you are however you are changing you're changing you're changing have faith that everything will work itself out as well some of you guys you may get lost in fantasy or you may find yourself just uh, stargazing or you're, you're more attracted to outer space um, some of you guys may even find a comet or a shooting star make a wish on it if you want to um, but the reason for you being very interested in outer space or um, stars and comets whatever the case may be is because they want you to understand the unknown of yourself or the unknown of your path do not be afraid to jump into the unknown but always be aware of what you're getting yourself into move with caution is what they're saying as well some of you you're going to have weird dreams of like people staring at you or you may see a spirit like just staring at you kind of like how this lady is on the card how she's just like just staring at you just very blank face the angels they want you to go through 
this situation right now with the poker face like don't let anyone see you sweat because some people may have been wishing bad upon you or it's like people people just don't need to know your business okay so just be selective with who you tell and sometimes you can't even tell the people who you select to tell your business to so just once again be aware of your surroundings all right if you're going through a difficult time you want to tell somebody you can but you don't always have to all right next we have let go very interesting it's definitely time for you to obviously let go of something that isn't giving you great purpose some of you you are going through this difficult time right now because you're holding on so tightly to something that has expired or it's just it's not meshing with you all right and you can honestly just take that how you want to but also i'm getting confirmation with going into the unknown the angels they want you to let go of that fear with going into the unknown with going into understanding your spirituality with going into different dimensions with astral projection but just once again protect yourself understand your surroundings understand what you're putting yourself into understand the risk that um a particular situation may cause you but some of you in in order for you to gain the good you are going to have to just be open to everything that comes with it you're going to have to be open to just spreading your wings some of you okay eventually you are going to have to tell your story all right when i said to sometimes like people don't need to know your business even if you're going through a hard time because some of the people that you select to tell your business to is not the right people to tell your business to yes someone does need to hear your story yes but just make sure you're telling it to the right people just because you're depressed and you're going through you know a hard time nine times out of ten some people they do not give a fuck and when you tell people about your business you're just venting all right let go of that worry let it all go vent to yourself honey vent to yourself and be your own your own cheerleader right now all right oh my nose is itching sorry all right another thing that your divine god and angels want you to know you guys have two cards move moving forward fiercely environmental awareness oh my god this is so confirming so you guys move forward move forward yes be cautious of everything but go into the unknown do what you have to do to make everything right for you and i find it really interesting how we got environmental awareness there is something going on you know whether it's with the weather or it's just with you and this is definitely confirmation of you you need to just let that negativity go some of y'all you need to let go of the fact that you can't control everything because you're, you're trying to go in this direction but your divine god and angels are like hey oh no we want you to go this way so you're just gonna have to let go of the fact that just because you pictured a particular life for you doesn't mean that it's the best life for you your divine god and angels are helping you during this time you ask for help they're giving it to you accept it all right don't fight it Thank you for your time. All right, people that chose card number three. What's in store for you? What your divine God and angels want you to know during this time? Passion ignited. This is the Ace of Wands. So some of you, you definitely need to feel warm again. Maybe you felt dead for some time. Maybe you felt neglected. Maybe you neglected yourself for a little bit. Your heart has been hurting. You're dealing with a lot and you're taking a lot of things to the heart. Um, maybe even some things that are not even meant for you to take personally, but you're doing so anyway because you have a lot that you're holding on to. You're bottling your problems and you need to let 
them out in another way besides anger. I am picking up that some of you, you need to fall in love with sex again or with the fall, falling in love with sex with the right partner again or you need to, um, this may sound kind of funny, or you need to masturbate more to release all that sexual tension. But you want your heart to feel whole again. You, you want to feel alive again and this will happen. But you're going to have to stop taking things so personal. You're going to have to just fall in love with you again. Fall in love with life. Fall in love with your career again. You know, because I, I just feel like many of you, you just kind of lost hope. It's like you, you're trying to be hopeful, but at the same time, it's just like, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever you have going on with your heart, whether it's, you know, your emotions, your depression, your heartache, um, if you have any health issues with your heart, heart attack, um, heart failure, for some of you, you are going to have to let that heal, okay? Some of you, there's going to be a complete change going on in your life, whether you completely change your career, you completely change your self-esteem, you completely just up and leave and go to a different city, state, country, you know, and you're just starting over fresh. The angels really want you to start over, all right? Now you have a blank state, right? Good things, only good things. Have good actions, move in a new and good direction. Um, this is your starting point. Don't fail us, is what they're saying as well. Relax, relax. Have fun if you want to, but just fall in life, fall in love with life again. Go outside, feel the warmth, feel the snow, feel the grass, feel the dirt, feel the water, feel the wind. Like just feel every inch of Mother Nature. That's going to make you just feel rejuvenated and calm. But hell, start a garden if you want to. Um, buy some flowers. Like just just feel. Feel me is what the angels are saying. Just feel Mother Earth. Feel that your angels are around you. Honestly, you you kind of blocked your um, crown chakra as well is what they're saying too. Um, so you definitely have some issues going on with your heart and crown chakra right now that you're going to have to heal. But right now it just starts with you healing your heart and falling in love with your angels again as well. Alright, what else? do you have choose a new direction oh my god this is definitely confirming like the new slate okay now the angels are not saying to for some of you for some of you honey they are not saying for you to completely drop what you were doing before maybe you still have that there in regards to career okay um, maybe still have that if you still have love for it but now it's time for you to expand. It's time for you to just do what feels right to you. Your soul is speaking out for a reason. It is speaking out for a reason. Um, so some of you are definitely going to move. You know, some, some of you, there's going to be a lot of changes happening. And they may be scary. And um, you're going to have to be gonna have to be prepared and have faith always have faith the moment you lose faith is when this shit go downhill always have faith but definitely confirming that it's, it's time for you to do something new okay what else do you have what's going on peace of mind regardless of this new direction and like where it's going to take you have faith like i said and have a peace of mind that everything is going to work out you guys mm, funny how i said the crown chakra there's something going on in the crown chakra Me mentally there's a lot going on and you're, you're placing a lot of pain on your heart and on your mind all right and for some of you it may be causing a lot of back problems because you feel as if you aren't supported or Maybe you aren't able to really support yourself and your family the way that you want to. But once again, your divine God and angels, they want you to have peace. 
have peace in your mind meditate if you have to go outside for the earth like i said earlier um eat good food you know um connect with yourself again just really relax that's really all the angels want you to know right now just relax bitch damn like you you've been going through a lot you got a lot going on just relax it's gonna be all right it's gonna be all right but thank you guys so much for watching good luck with everything and let's see what's going on for people who chose card number four what messages do your divine god and angels have in store for you disruption this is actually the tower card okay the song move get out the way by little chris popped in my head so some of you it's, it's time for you to move or someone is, has has been in your way for a long time or a boulder has been in your way and you're like you're ready to move it but there has been a lot of stress there has been a lot of stress i can't say I, it's like i want to say stretch and stress so some of you guys you need to stretch all right um the reason why you may be having a lot of like tense muscles or pains is because you you need to stretch you need to work that body part out you need to work those muscles and joints out all right so please go to a pursuit if you want to or just stretch do yoga um exercise is a bit extreme if you want to exercise cool but for right now just work on stretching all right but this has caused a lot of stress for many of you and it's showing within your body some of y'all you feel as if you've been locked up for a very long time or it's like there's no movement there's no movement and you're just like okay what what do i do next i don't know what to do and mentally it's like you are exploding all right and it's showing you some of you guys you may fall out with friends you may fall out with family members you may explode on a stranger due to your lack of direction or movement but your divine god and angels they want you to understand in order for things to work out you have to stretch your body i know that sounds kind of funny but that's really what they're pretending to they're, you're, you're tense you're too tensed up um some of you guys you need a bigger home you, you need to clean your home and make more space is what they're saying um, make making room for things it's time to make room for things um there's this thing where uh, how to attract a lover you make room for that lover you sleep on one side of the bed you make a plate of food for yourself and you put it on the other side of the table for your lover um you speak your lover into existence um it's like the attracting you're attracting it be mindful of your negative thoughts because your negative thoughts and your worries are attracting negative things and worry to continue you guys are definitely going to have to change your state of mind um there's also this some of you um i hate to say this but i keep picking up on mental retar retardation by the time you guys have this or you're dealing with someone that has this and it's just like always like this person is very rowdy or they get angry really quick and you have to deal with this person um some of you guys you you feel crazy you feel crazy and you don't like to feel crazy you don't you don't like your thoughts you don't like just the negative things that's been going on but honey this will all stop once you to stretch it on out stretch stretch your body stretch it out all right what else do you guys need to know no whatever question you wanted to know or well, whatever answer you wanted to know the answer is no For some of you, no, you will not continue down this road. No, something may not be the right time. No, it's not meant for you. No, you shouldn't give up on this person. 
no, you shouldn't be with this person. Whatever you've been asking yourself, the answer is no. For many of you, it okay. Some of y'all, you you've just been ignoring your angels and you've been doing what you want to do and for some of you the reason why you the reason why you're going through a lot of difficulty is because you didn't listen to when they told you no the first time you was just like okay well you said no but are you sure i'm going to keep doing it anyway just to see if it'll change and now you're in this weird predicament because you didn't listen the first time so there's a lot of hard-headedness going on okay um and it's like you, you're you want to have to get yourself out of it you know the answer stick with that don't go back to it thinking things are going to change and be dandy this time no 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 you've put yourself in this tricky situation now you're going to have to get out of it it's kind of like being stuck between a rock and a hard place and it's like you got to squeeze and stretch your way out of it once again you guys are going to have to stretch stretch everything out stretch everything out all right now what else do you guys need to know beauty even though things are kind of rocky and kind of weird see the beauty within it all some of you guys you may some of you are going through uh what's it um ooh, menopause midlife crisis or you know how like when women go through a weird breakup or they go through something like kind of drastic they they make drastic changes to their hair or to themselves it's kind of like you're going through that like you just you want to change you want to just you, you feel like you can't change your situation so you're just going to change something about yourself physically that's what the angels are saying um but once again just see the beauty in this downfall see the beauty in this weird situation once you see the beauty and the blessing and the purpose of it all that's when you're going to be able to just understand that no it wasn't meant to work out no it's not the right time no i, I can't keep doing this once you let that get to your head you're going to be able to feel sane again you're going to be able to just get things back in order but just don't be so hard-headed this time, okay? Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this. Good luck with everything. And I shall see you in the next video. Bye.